Hello. Hey, baby. Are you having fun today? Yes. <laughs> okay, do you want to go first or do you want me to go first? Ladies first. Oh, okay. All right. I love you. I love you too. Braxton Joseph Pennington, you are my love, my best friend, my everything, my soulmate. God has blessed me with the most perfect man. You are the most loving and selfless person I have ever met, and I knew from the moment I saw you, you are my forever. I remember telling Sydney the first time I talked to you that you are my soulmate. You have been my one and only true love ever since that day. Everything you do is in love, and you always put me first no matter what. There are so many things I have learned about you. You are loving, caring, determined, and selfless. You are truly my better half. Sorry, I have to turn the page. <laughs> From now until eternity, I promise to always put you first in everything I do. God knew you were the other half I was missing. He created you for me and me for you. You are perfect for me in every way. You are truly the man of my dreams. You are the man I've prayed for and you are the only person in this world I can imagine spending eternity with. No matter the struggles life may put us through, I know we will stay strong together. With Jesus as our center and the love we share through him, I know no matter the challenge, our love will only grow stronger. My heart belongs to you and it always will. I am so ready to begin life with you and live this dream over and over again each day. Each and every day we will continue to grow together as we begin our lives. I promise to be your best friend, to laugh with you every day, to shake the small things and to enjoy every single moment with you. I know sometimes I complain about the laundry being next to the basket or the dishes in the sink. But I promise to never take the little things you do for granted, because if I didn't have you, I wouldn't be complete. Braxton, I promise to support you in everything you do. I will always be in your corner, and I will choose you no matter what. I promise to be your biggest fan and your loudest cheerleader. I promise to follow God's plan and guidance with you as my partner, and I will choose you each and every day. And I will always choose you. Because of you, I laugh and smile. Today and forever, I cannot begin to express into words how truly blessed I am to be yours. I get to be your wife, your best friend, the future mother of your children, and your forever. It's the greatest gift I will ever receive. You complete me, and after our time together, I couldn't imagine this life without you. My heart skips a beat when I see you, and I get butterflies when we kiss. The best day of our lives is here, and it's only the beginning. Braxton Joseph Pennington, I love you more today than I have ever loved anything, and I know... And I know, <laughs> the wind. I know our love will only continue to grow. Thank you for being you and for choosing me each and every day. You will always be my one and only, my soulmate, the love of my life, my person, my best friend, and my forever. I cannot wait to spend the rest of my life with you, Brax. I love you more than you'll ever know. Here's to the beginning of our forever. Love your sweetheart. Did I do good? That's a good one. That, I really dug deep in my heart. Are you proud of me? <laughs> I would so proud of you. <laughs> All right, are you ready for mine? Yes, I'm ready. Okay. It's funny how life works. When you're not searching for someone, you end up finding the person that is meant to be yours forever. And that is always going to be you, sweetheart. You're such an amazing woman, so strong, and I couldn't imagine life without you. And when I was away from you, I felt like I was missing a part of myself. Something in my soul just knew that it, miss, it was missing its best friend and its other half. I know when I put that ring on your finger today, and I say I do, I will never have to experience that feeling ever again. I love you so much, and I will never truly understand how much you mean to me. You're the girl of my dreams, my soulmate, my best friend, and mo most importantly, my soon-to-be wife. I, I can't wait to watch you walk down those steps like the princess you truly are. And I promise you will be treated like one in this life and in eternity. 
And I know that when it, we are together, we're the strongest thing that we could have possible. And I love you more than life itself. And I, I couldn't do anything without you now. I love you more than anything. Brianna, love Brax. I love you too. Can I just see you already? Or no, 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 don't turn around. I, I just want to give a shout out to my two best friends that have done everything in the world for me through baseball, through my life, and for me and Bree, especially in this time of our age, trying to do college and everything. And it's my mom and dad, my my best friends since day one. Would you please stand for the bride? It was your college speech class. I believe Braxton got up to give his speech. You remember what it was on? Yep. Okay. Red dirt music, headphones, and, and uh, water. Okay, so <laughs> I didn't know that was going to be the answer. But for those of you who didn't hear, his speech was on red dirt music, headphones, and water, right? Okay. Uh, and Brianna is listening to him give his speech. And um, from the moment she saw him, she says that she couldn't breathe during that speech. And, and she was so focused on him, she didn't catch his name. And so she just tried to find out who he was by referring to him as the cute country boy who gave the speech. But that same day, she went to Sydney and she told Sydney, Braxton, that you were her soulmate. And she has looked forward to this day ever since that day. Braxton, you may kiss your bride.